Hello everyone. Welcome to Tuesday. Welcome to Tuesday. I apologize first off for the Louis Vuitton bags under my eyes and second off for the lack of lighting. We um, left our studio lights in Minnesota. We so. are trying to get a ring light, like a new light, and we, we got, got one. one. Awful. It was terrible. It literally gave off no light. So if you have a recommendation, <laughs> yes, leave your ring <laughs> light recommendations light. below. Um, we should have it fixed by next video. This is a haul. And if you're interested in anything that we show you, as usual, you can email us, which the email is the first thing below, or you can contact us on Instagram. A lot of you did that last time. Thank and you. And a lot of thank you appreciated you, you. your prices and your deals. So yes. I'm glad we could give you some cute clothes. And thank you guys for your purchases. Before we start though, we want to say thank you to two people that sent us items to our PO box. This says packages. Um, first up is Chris. She sent this nice card, which I'm not gonna show you guys all of. And then she sent us some spare fossil she says, dust bags. Dust bag. and which then, oh, and, and the, this and the garment bag. Yes. Bags. And like one of the garment like <laughs> zip-up bags. Those are so nice. Those now. will certainly come in handy. I like never find fossil dust bags. So I kinda be... forgot that they made dust bags, but I'm very thankful that we now have some. Yeah, because we do pick up fossils, so those will come we in. We do. Handy. And then the incomparable Cindy Boom Boom. Yeah. Cynthia. Hello. She sent us this one's Jax. Um some adorable well, tie-dye that she made. She sent us some tie-dye she made, which like, she said like, how did I do? I'm like, are you like, kidding? This looks like- She said in her card, she said, P.S. Ryan, what grade do I get on my tie-dye? Yeah. You're an egg, Cynthia. You did amazing. I love it. These are so it's cute. It's so cute. And she wrote to, uh, wrote this little card about what yeah. Swell needs in her surfing town. And a pug one. These are so cute. And it says, what the pug. What the pug. I love um, it. And she sent us a few more things, but we really wanted to show you guys how good she did at tie-dyeing. So thank you. And now that that's all that I ever wear. I and, live in this. And thank you, Mandy and her daughter, Reese. <gasps> she sent us friendship bracelets. Oh my God, they're She's, adorable. It's so cute. Like, I love them. They're so adorable. And they made us like so happy. So thank all three of you. Thank you, guys you are lovely so ladies amazing. for sending us all these lovely goodies. Yeah. Brian's going to start because he looks like he might have a little bit more than me. Mm -hmm. This is all from like thrifting, but not necessarily like the same place. And none of it has been, I don't believe. No. Maybe a few things in mind, but that's mm -hmm. it. Um, I would also like to apologize for my hair this morning. It looks awful. I don't know why. It's like, whoosh. I think that means it's time for me to get a haircut. Probably. Anyway, okay, let's do, I have two bags. So this is the first one. It's so pretty. It's just kind of like grandma looking bag. And it is by Anthropology. And these are like, like these are really like strong handles. And then it just kind of has like the raffia back. In the bottom and i was kind of weary when i got this because i wanted to make sure none of the little like stitches had come out they have not which is good anthropology bags are like kind of rare finds but they're and always they're expensive so expensive i looked it up this one was like 178 dollars yeah. i feel like they used to have some that were cheaper when they would do like well, they did like yeah they had or... like how anthro like brings in other companies but like i think now they only ever have like either really really expensive like kind of like kitschy designer bags or like they do their own thing. Yeah, but I, even when you see the little clutches now in the real store, they're like oh my 60 God, they're bucks. Like nine, they're like 60 to $90, yeah. they're so expensive. Yeah. Okay, anyway, next, this is a brand, I do not find a ton, but I'm very happy when I do. This was Matt and Nat. Um, the one thing about this brand is that it's all vegan. So there's no actual leather in it, but it's really good quality. It's like affordable Stella McCartney, kind of. It really is. I it mean, not, comes... obviously not that quality, but like so it's, it's still like, very nice quality. I didn't even realize it was like this. It's like a messenger, kind of, and it has the long strap, and the interior, the back has a, and one little pocket on the back, yeah. there's a pocket on the front. You can just like put the long strap inside if you want the yeah, short one. Yeah, what is this interior little message say? The lining is made from 100% recycled plastic bottles. We recycle an average of 2 million plastic bottles a year. Good for them. Yeah, they're like a very green company. And they sell really well. I remember I had one that didn't and then Jack sold it for like 50 bucks, like mm -hmm. the next day, which was great. Let's do shoes. Um, okay, so these are made well. I, full disclosure, got these at the Nordstrom Rack sale. Very happy about it. These are the Boardwalk Classic Lace Up Sandal in a size eight. These are super cute. It's just kind of like a plain black sandal with the like gladiator detail. And Madewell sandals the side. use the nicest leather. It's, it's like such bags. good quality leather. It's oh thick my god. And it's nice. Yeah. I love those. Um, okay, these are a bit deceitful. Is there anything in here? No. No. That's a spare toy birch box. Oops. <laughs> I'll tell you what was in there though was these. I got a ton of pairs of these. They are Steve Madden. They are called the Fab Fuzz. Sue, which like they, that name makes me want to vomit. But what are you gonna do? 
Um, they're kind of a dupe for the Ugg slippers. <laughs> Fab fuzz. What are the, the name of those Ugg slippers? Oh. I have a pair, but they're very comfortable. Um, I used to have three pairs and then I sold out. So if you want one more, these are a size eight as well. One time I had three gumballs and then I ate one. No, now I only have two. two. <laughs> I had four biscuits and I ate one. Then I only had three. Oof, that's a bro. SpongeBob okay. reference of the video. <laughs> okay, so these, what are these called? Um, it doesn't say. So, um, these I think, are really pretty. I think it's a boardwalk sandal, just like the flat, but these are in the silver metallic, super cute. Um, and these are a size nine. And I will do my very, very, very best, if you do want a pair, to ship them in a shoebox, because I know some people like to have shoeboxes, but if you would not like a shoebox, let me know. And I'll make ship it a little easier. Yeah. Okay. Maybe a better price. Yes. <laughs> okay, so last one is Boardwalk Ankle Strap Sandal in leather. Okay, these are super cute. Kind of like a little... They look, are they size six? Smaller? Um, these are a size eight and a half. Oh, wow. Interesting. I don't know where it was going with... They look like a... Like an ankle strap? Like a gladiator? Yeah. They're super cute though. And this I is such good hair. quality leather. And the inside is really soft. Yeah. So it's not gonna like rub on your foot and like... Know, rip your foot in half okay okay um so my first one this is my only pair of shoes to show you guys so these are stuart weitzman and that is the new stuart weitzman like logo um they're like a bow detail ballerina they're flat, really and they're cute. actually brand new they've never been worn I know. and they're size six but i love this like baby blue color and I actually really love selling newer Stuart Weitzman. They do really well. And there's just, everyone knows how Stuart Weitzman are so expensive. Obviously the old ones, ugh. I think if it's like a but, trendy style, yeah. you probably get away with it. I will say though, I wish I would've found a pair of those boots. The like knee high Stuart Weitzman boots. Yeah. Okay. Next up is a classic. These I never, ever, 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 ever pick up Michael Kors anymore. Um, but the Hamilton, which is what this is, is like their most sought after bag and they discontinued it a long time ago. They've made kind of like imitations since, yeah. but a lot of people like the classic Hamilton. I'm not sure if it has kind of like Hermes look for some people. I don't know. Cause it has the strap that goes across, but people really like this bag. And so it's like the only Michael Kors I'll still pick up. It's really nice on the inside and it's really nice black leather. There's like not really anything wrong. A couple spots on the bottom that I'll rub some leather some conditioner or some dye on it. Yeah. Um, just keep that. Just needs to be like reshaped. Yeah. Next up, we have a Sundance size small. We love we have went on like a roller coaster with Sundance. We used to love it. Then we had and this we whole it. long time where we just couldn't sell it at all and we like we're like I'm not getting it anymore. Now we've like dabbled back in and they've all sold really quick. Mm -hmm. So we're kind of picking it up again. I think I'm going to get it if it's like not super. If it's a newer tag or if it looks more mm -hmm. like Free People Johnny Wuzzy. Yes. Then it does well. This is really cute because it has these like embroidered suns and stars in it. And it's like actually gold. Oh, is that what they are? Yeah. Oh, I thought they were flowers. They're really pretty. Yeah. No, this is really cute. The like neckline is a little dated, but like. It's a little boat. But not everyone always like needs to wear the most up to date clothing <laughs> styles. Um, oh, oh, this, this is cute. so cute. So this is Young, Fabulous and Broke. That's their newer tag. And it's a size extra small. This could fit. Probably up to a large. Fit a plethora Literally, of this is not it's an very extra small, stretchy. and it's so, yeah, it's like jersey, um, but it is a tie dye jumpsuit. It's so cute, like an ombre tie dye like, jumpsuit. Like ocean waves or like skies, almost like it's. This would be so comfortable so to like, travel in. <laughs> it has the wrap front and short sleeves. I'm just like this is. I love this. This is adorable. I like never find Young Fabulous and Baroque. I kind of come into a ton of it all of a sudden. Usually if I, I do, they're like mm, kind of lackluster. It's that older tag with those two spooky dudes on yeah. it. <laughs> okay, next up, this is Current Air, which can be Anthropology, and this is Anthropology. It's a size small. It's so cute. Though. And it's this really adorable like cut out lace, kinda flower kind of lace. I love this like lavender like yeah they have it it's like really layered pretty. it's like the brown black pattern and then it has this like lavender purple slip layer underneath. under it and there is some stretch so it could maybe be sized up one size um show one more 
This is a new with tag Levi's. Um, I, this was like originally like a hundred bucks or something. Levi's is not She's always that She's hiking kind of expensive. <laughs> um, and this is so, it's like a galaxy or like it's space re, it's like situation. A, it reminds me of, um. It's a velour Oh, also. look at that stuff you put on like a Christmas tree. Tinsel? Like tinsel. Yeah, it reminds me of like, my grandma had this like multi-color <laughs> tinsel. Yeah, but it's and velour it and it has metallic like stripes in it of a bunch of different colors. So really I pretty. really, really like that. And did I say the size? Size small. <laughs> okay, first up for me, this is an anthropology moth sweater. It's adorable. Size small. I am obsessed with this thing. I think it's so cute. I have a feeling a perfect view, for a the last. Is probably gonna want to buy this before it gets on there. Yeah, perfect for the final day Pride Month. <laughs> um, and it's really cute because it's like in between the the color is like like white. Mm. I don't know. I think it's super cute. Uh, and then the it's back like is almost the same. like spray dyed it yeah. or something. Same same homebrew. Okay, this is a pair of mother jeans. Uh, mother jeans, digging for the size, it's kind of difficult. These are a size twenty six, and they are kind of a plain player, a plain player, plain player of blue jeans with the raw hem on them. Super cute. Um, do these have a name? They usually in them. Um, the looker. looker. That's always the looker. Rancho. Diablo. I think the looker is like the high Ranch skinny, devil. <laughs> and so you literally always find the looker. Mm-hmm. Why I the watch of these is called the Rancho Diablo. The Ranch Devil. Yeah. Rancho. I guess. Show I me. Know what show me where. Is. You know. Rancho. I don't know. I took Spanish, but I know El Diablo is the devil. <laughs> I took Spanish. I don't know in El Rancho school. though. <laughs> That's if you know what Rancho means. In Spanish, <laughs> tell us what that please tell means. me. <laughs> Um, okay, so this, uh, one of my favorite brands to pick up, especially for plus size stuff. I found they only this, make plus size I found this and I gave it to I you. think this is adorable. This is Eloquy. Eloquy, however you say it, size 20. But like, look That's at so this. That's so cute though. This is what LuLaRoe wanted to be. I probably should have bought that. It's so cute. And it's not like that cheapy, kind of Ooh, like printed it's material. Like, like, like it's a really like not exactly, thick, but, good yeah. material. Scuba, kind of, a thinner scuba. Is it just kind of like viscose? Yeah, it's just so cute though. But like, I love this floral print too. Yeah. Cause it's like floral, but it's more of an abstract floral. Big fan. Okay. Um, when they bagged this, I forgot what it was. It's MG. I had a feeling. I love MG. This I handed to him also. <laughs> um, this is MG size medium, and it's so pretty. So pretty. With like the feather print. Yeah. Inside. It has like all these really. They like, kind of look like mandalas. Yeah. Honestly, and the tassels, and does it have like a. No, but it has like a prairie waist. Ryan sells MG a lot better than I do. So it's like Laura Angles Wilder. But I know it's more, again, like the boho y type stuff that sells. Yeah. Better. And like, I'll sell it for a ton. Like, I'll probably get maybe 30 bucks for it. But like, they're very cute. Okay, so this is the new, newest Sundance tag. And this is an extra small. And it's this really funky, like. It's ultra suede. Is it ultra suede or is it suede? I bought it because it's I was like, suede. ooh, fun. But I, I haven't. I really don't think that's so. It'd be a lot heavier. Yeah, I think it would too. These are suede. These are heavy. 100% <laughs> so genuine leather. Oh, so it is leather. Wow. Hmm. Oh, I guess. Yeah, it feels like leather. It's really soft. But it's super cute. It has this kind of like whip stitched yeah. detail on it and a zipper on wow. the back. It's leather. But I will say, if you are going to list Sundance, do not use the model picture. No. Robert Redford says, don't take my pictures. <laughs> Please don't take my things. Okay, so this, full disclosure, I'm gonna try on and see if it fits me, because I really like it. Um, it is BDG Urban Outfitters, which is kind of like one of the cheaper, cheaper That's like, and relative it's Urban like, Outfitters. It's like the Maeve Anthropology. It really, it's like the A by Anthropology. Because well, it's no, very, it yeah. It was what Maeve was. It's very, like, It's like the one the that under. they own, and they use all the time. It's their big, they make a lot of denim. And it's the cheap bird. And this is denim. One. Yeah. But it's this really, really, really pretty, kind of like cottony looking, oh, sorry, denim, kimono Skip sleeve. Smacked. <laughs> Little like jacket. I really hope this fits me because I can see myself wearing this a ton. But if not, one of y'all can have it. Okay, I think that was five. Okay. That was five. So I will go into my suede item then. I did not yet know that Anthropology really uses heavy. like real leather, but they do mm -hmm. apparently. So I this is just by Anthropology. I knew on their bag that they did. And it's this nice like wine Ooh. 
colored, Ooh. slightly flared, um, pair of suede pants. Pair of suede pants. Are they high waisted? They retailed at about two hundred dollars, and they're brand new with tags. Um, they are high waisted. Oh, they smell like suede. At all, yeah. It smells like Bottega oh, Veneta suede. It does smell like a Bottega Veneta. Um, but yeah, it's just like it's got some like seams going across a couple spots. It's really nice. They're, they're really pretty. They're really. They're like heavy, but not too heavy. Like they're, you feel like you're wearing something nice, but it's not like you're they're not gonna like down. weigh you down. Yeah. You're not gonna be like, oh my god, this oh, and like they were pounds. a size four, so not like an awful size to have either. Um, next up we have Target Peter Pilato. The Target brand, the Target collabs are pretty cheap and like don't resell usually. Ryan has had good luck with Lily Pulitzer I sell. jumpsuits. There's one Lily Pulitzer jumpsuit. I sell it every time I find it. It's from the newer Lily collab. Um, but I always pick up this Peter Pilato one because it's just so pretty. I love pretty. the print. It's so pretty. Yeah. And this funky like. I've had it as a plus size swimsuit and it did sell. Obviously, again, not for like a ton. Oh, yeah. But I think they're really cute. They are really cute. Next up, we have a pair of high rise denim legging by Pilcrow and Letterpress by Anthropology, which again, like we say, means it's a newer one and it's size 29. The model pictures for these are really cute. They may look a little plain on the video, but trust me, they're very They cute. are really cute. They fit really well. Yes, they do. They're getting quite a bit of legs already. Those are actually listed. Not all, most of this is not listed, but those are. Next up. We got a mesh athleta hat. Oh, that one size fits all. Yeah, cute, cute. A little white hat. Then I've got a hat hat. A assets by Spanx bra, um, and it is a size thirty six B. So yeah, <laughs> this literally this was a Ben's find, and obviously this weighed probably a third of me. Really so, Yeah. Then I'm going to just include both of these because I have two of these and they're actually the same size so I don't even need to lift up the other one. I have this, they call it the Retro 90s Like text. logo. Yeah. I've had these before, they're really um, cute. Levi Strauss and Co. bodysuit. They're so pretty. Um, and yeah, they're both a size large and this would have been good for Pride probably, but it's the last day. I think so. if I remember correctly, those were sold on ASOS. Yes. As well, the Asos website. Okay, um, let's do whatever this is. What is this? I don't know. Oh, this is so cute. It's Corey Lynn Coulter. Anthropology. But look at how cute this little tank shop is. Is it's, that snakes? Yeah. <gasps> it's like, um, the little ab, the little the aboriginal art from that's Australia. so cute. I've seen that. And I don't remember if it was someone messaging me saying they like were looking for it so to keep my eye open or if I just saw it online <laughs> and I was like, that's adorable. Um, it's a size small. Ooh, I love that. Super cute. Yeah. This I took a gamble on. It is, oh, here we go. Okay, please nobody, nobody <laughs> crucify me for this. Okay, give me a minute. It's Artillier Nicole Miller. This <laughs> is an expensive Nicole Miller. And it's this kind of like furry floral crop top. Oh. I think it's kind of cute. Like, you know, I don't hate it. It's, it's like a clown's chest hair. <laughs> You're not going to make anybody want to buy it. It's, it's cute oh. though. I think it was part of a two piece. Yeah. I mean, but it's like I a floral like it. print. It's just from my angle, I can't like see the print. No, oh yeah, okay. See, see like... from the front, it looks cute. I'm just seeing like... <laughs> <laughs> it did look a little funky on that, I will say. But, um, who was it? Nick in Sierra Breeze Sales told me the Artillier Nicole Miller is the expensive. It is, yeah. Nicole Miller, so I trust him. Okay, um, I have no idea what this is. Oh, there's the... Leave it to Ryan. He just buys a bunch of stuff. I buy it and then I instantly this? forget what it is the minute it's mine. So this is free people. That's really cute. Size, extra small, as they all are. But it's this really pretty little white could kind of fit cross probably red. a small, maybe a medium. Oh, this could fit like yeah, definitely yeah. medium. Um, with these really pretty white lace sleeve details and the little kind of like elastic bottom, and it's just plain in the back. Yeah, very cute. Was that five? No, no. I have a few more. Two this more. is another um G again. I love this. By this me is so Ryan. cute. This is a size small. And it's this mm. kind of like basic jersey uh, long sleeve with these really funky sleeves. This is what sells it. They're it's so like bell cute. Sleeves. That's it's like what I knit love. bell sleeves, and it's a really and it's like different kinds of knits too. 
It's like this one's a little thinner. It's a very, yeah, it's this like one's a little lighter. And then thinner. It's a little and then thicker. Textured. It's cute. And it's weird cut. though, like the bodice, J. Crew. The sweet. She's very like, like the fake gory three ninety nine like t shirt. And then you spice it up a little bit. This is, I think this is Meadow Rue. That's really pretty. <coughs> I ha I haven't seen what he got, so. This is Meadow Rue by Anthropology, size small. Oh, it's like velvet. I love this. <gasps> I think it's so pretty. It's this like really funky. Oh my god. Like velvet with these pretty gold accents in it. We'll take shot. Dang, I really like that. I know. I thought this was. Is so it Meadow cute. Rue by Anthropology? No, I think oh. I think it's the one that they used before. Yeah, it is. So it's wow, not like, I'm surprised that's it's not, not the really newest, cool. but it's not the oldest. She's the one in the middle. Yeah. I love it. And this is a size small, if I did not say. Okay. Um, I think it's your turn. Okay. I have this Maeve. This is um, really cute. And it's a size US 2. It's just this like, it has the cutout at the top and the back and kind of like ruffles. And then it's this just like pleated type tank and it ties up to be like a bow around the neck. It's a little pussy bow. Um, yeah. Cute. It's really cute. I like that color. I love that color. Yeah. Ugh, so this is what was in the thumbnail. Thumbnail. Yeah, that's the right word. All of a sudden I was like, did I, I say that right? like, who's she? It's a size XL mod cloth. This is probably my favorite thing I'm showing in this haul because it's so cute. It is really cute. It's this like oh. strawberry striped printed bomber. Literally, I would almost wear this myself. This is so cute. It's I so love pretty. me a bomber. So and the cute little strawberries on it. Yeah, love it. It's so cute. It has two front pockets, big red zipper. That's adorable. Love it. I like never find mod cloth, so I was I don't pretty excited. Either. Next up is a Banana Republic <laughs> size small. I do not grab Banana Republic much, and if I do, it's from the bins, and this is a bins find, this but it is cashmere? like, yeah, it's a cashmere it's wool really blend. It's really soft. And it's like this leopard, gray leopard kind of print. Mm -hmm. And like, we all know that leopard and cheetah is in, so I thought I'd It'd be give her a shot. Cute little layering piece. Next is Bowden, which I feel like I haven't found I in forever. I thought this was a LuLaRoe tag, and I was about to have a pink. It is tag. a size 10R. <laughs> So a regular 10. And it's this it's really, really cute, pretty. like, speckly pattern. I think they're meant to be, like, little bouquets of flowers. Yeah, maybe. But it's still so cute, though. Yeah, it almost gives me 4th of July vibes, too. Mm -hmm. I don't really know why. It's kind of like fireworks. They do look like fireworks. This, I really like. Ryan didn't like it at first. I don't know if he likes it I did it see it on a mannequin, and I will say it definitely looks better with a body in it. It's Trina Turk, LA, which, like, Trina Turk is super expensive, but we all know it doesn't always, like, sell so very well. Nothing. But it has this cute mock neck that has this adorable print to it. And then it's this, like, long sleeve dress. I will say, I do like this. I think this is really pretty. I really appreciate the mock this, neck. This, like... And that the mock the neck pattern. pattern matches the, like, waist mm -hmm. stripe. And I do really like the funky, groovy colors. It's I very, know. like, 70s mom. Like, It really is. Very. It's like and Kitty this, from that 70s show. Literally. That's exactly what I was thinking. And the size is who knows where. She hides her sizes like it's I, a I, like, game. never sell Trina Turner. Like Trina. Um, there is no size. It is 100% silk. Uh, I'd probably say a small. A large or a medium. I wouldn't say small. Well, yeah, I'd definitely yeah. say medium. A uh, medium. A comfortable medium. But I can get measurements if you're interested. <laughs> okay, so this I picked up on a whim because I know this brand is expensive. It's Clue and Willoughby. That might be made well. Willow. Yeah. Willoughby, whatever. I don't know. Um, I think it's cute. I think. Little, I think it's I cute. Think it's cute. This is little like layered blue tank top, and it was only what, a couple of bucks. Yeah. So like, I don't know. I think it'll do good, and I like the color. Color's pretty. It is a size small. I find. I find. Um, what's this? I don't know. Oh, this is free people as well. This is a size medium, but it's intimately free people. That doesn't do anything. Size medium. Um, this is just really cute little pink. But it has Ooh, really nice kind of like, like swingy dress. But it does have these gold metallic really pretty kind of like they look like the things in like a paisley pattern, like oh, little gold accents. So shiny. On the back. Very cute. Um, oh, these are a find. So this these is I also handed This is me. new without tag Vince. And this is also the newest tag for Vince. And they're these really, really, really cute kind of like they kind of look like a cow print, but it's kinda not. 
Um, it's more geometric. Silk, like, oh, sorry, like plazo pants. <laughs> elbow me, like I'm really, like, times. not doing my good today. These are size extra, extra small, but they could definitely, like... Oh, yeah. They could fit, like, a regular extra small. That was, like, a remind me of, like, Lulu. Which I know. is so odd. I know. Except they're, they're silk, so... Oh, so. cute. Yeah, they are. I love those. Once again, I'm like, why didn't I get these? I know. Um... What's this? Oh, I know what this is. So this is Torn by Ronnie Kobo. I don't really ever find this brand at all, and I was very excited to find this one. But it's this really cute, like... That's cute. Romantic looking... Gives me some Love Shack fancy Like, vibes. white sweater. It reminds me of some Lauren as Wilder well, wear. Because <laughs> this is like... I feel like you bring her up at least once a day. She comes up a lot in my daily life. I don't know why. Um, this is a size large, and it does and have the... Jody Jodie Foster and Laura Ingalls Wilder. <sighs> beautiful um and it, the back is just kind of like a plain knit um this jack has had before I and i before. was very excited to find it's it it's very new it is maze by anthropology maze metal brew by anthropology size large mine this sold really i cute. think in like Blue, less than two days floral. And a bundle to someone that at least follows my instagram she i love watch. this this is my favorite part it's so pretty and it's yeah. so soft um, I'm not 100% sure if this is silk, but I it would so. not surprise me if it was. Yeah. Super cute. Okay. Next up for me is another Levi's, new with tag, and it's this adorable shirt that if it was bigger, I would totally just keep oh, myself. Oh, this is so cute, though. But it's a size extra small, and it says far out, and it's far. silver and metallic, and it has stars around it. It's really cute. I, and I love the color. I wish that that could fit me. Next up is a Parker and I can just tell that this is a newer tag. The pink is the older, black is newer, but mm -hmm. still I can just, or this also has like never been worn. Um, it's like this uh, really are they like cute- Gemstones? Like, yeah, like or is it just kind kaleidoscope like almost the, print. Yeah, that's what it looks and like. And then it's like mesh. It's like a neoprene mesh. Yeah, there's a layer to like the body part, this white layer, but then the whole mesh is dyed that like kaleidoscope look. That's really And then pretty. the back zippers all the way like halfway down. Wow. Yeah. And that, that is a size extra small and it's pretty form fitting. So she's probably real maybe small. could do a small, but it wouldn't go much bigger. So this is a new brand to me. Let me know if you've ever sold it or heard of it even. It's called Stio, S-T-I-O. Hmm. And it gave me like Piranha vibes. I thought it was like, it's like butter sweater material. Yeah. Or like smart wool vibes right when I found mm -hmm. it. And so I Googled it and this, like hoodie originally was 180 bucks Damn. and so i thought i'd try it i do still need to depill it a bit but yeah. i think it was a bin sign so like, yeah the neck the like crosses over and i know like outdoorsy stuff can sometimes be so expensive but mm -hmm. it got thumb holes which is a detail debbie would always want to know my mother <laughs> and then it has the logo there. The little, they're fun little like what is it, an, an, avocado? an avocado <laughs> an avocado i'm thinking of an artichoke <laughs> It's an avocado. It's avocado. Hey. This I love. One of my other favorite things in this haul. This is really Chaser cute. size medium. And it says. I, lately I just like chasers. I love beach chasers. Beachfields. It says beach fields and it's like a distressed sweatshirt. But what are beach fields? But it's like super soft. It's not like thick cotton sweatshirt. No, it's, it's like really soft. soft inside, soft on the outside. But what is beach fields? Good question. Like, can somebody explain to me what beach fields are? Size medium. <laughs> This is huge. Let's see if I can, as in just like, it's a lot of knit. It's a lot of fabric. It's free people and it is size medium. And it is like this cowl neck. Is this the sidewinder? Really sweater? like slouchy. Nope. Again, I need to depill it a little bit. Um, really slouchy, cute, thick knit. Obviously not the season, but I don't care if free people sweaters are like, do really well. When you list it, put chunky in the title. Chunky. That's yeah, always what I do. I put knit. chunky in um, it's out. And it's a really cute, well. like blue mix of mm -hmm. pattern. Okay. Next we have a new, then I only have like, we have left. another new tag Sundance. Um, this one is a size small. And this is really pretty kind of like, very really like oceany blue with these really heavily embroidered that's kind of really like poofy sleeves. But all the floral embroidery going down them is a very, very pretty. And then the back is just plain, but it's a very cute. Okay, this is another new tag Vince piece. It is size medium. And this is a kind of a sweater dress. Every time you hold something up, you go like, 
No, you keep like. Oh, I do. You like hold it in and you bring it in like that, and you keep almost elbowing me. <laughs> um, it's just it's kind of like a sweater dress or kind of a tunic, depending on the person wearing it. But if you would like, I can provide you measurements. Very and it's really soft too. It's a really good. Okay, I'll save best for last. I don't know what this is. Free people. Okay. <laughs> I honestly forgot half this stuff. Uh, free people size large. It's super. Let me just. What? Yeah, you did. Let me that. let me clear some space here. It's really pretty. It has these big old. Oh wait. What is this? Is I think like it's a like a poncho? poncho. I think it's like a poncho. It is. Mm hmm. Huh. Well, there's kind of a sleeve. There's like a bat wing, but it does have this really pretty embroidery That's on the cool. front. It's I really didn't notice this was cool. fabric too. It's really soft. Yeah. And it's very flowy. Is that a hole? No, it's a clear stick. Okay. And then one of my favorite things I've ever found. I love this thing so much. If I can find the head hole, that would be great. Right here. Okay. So it's Denim and Supply Ralph Lauren. Size medium large, which they do not make anymore. But it's this so cute, like, multicolored poncho with a hood. Oh, I love the colors. I love that it has this like tassel-y detail at the bottom with a pocket and it does have the two little drawstrings in the front. A nice front. Like, stitching detail. Yes, and it has this like multicolored like whip stitch on yeah. the front. I love this thing. It's so cute. Okay. And it's also so big. So here's my last stuff. Okay. Got this current Elliot again. Looks like it's never been worn because it's such a clean, crisp tag. It is. It's, I love this print though. We had said that we don't really get current Elliot anymore, which is still mm -hmm. true, but this is adorable. Again, it almost gives me Lulu vibes. It's yeah, this I could see that. sweatshirt with these like purple flowers on it. But it's like longer in the front than it is in the back. And then it splits in the back. So it's almost, oh, it's almost like okay. athletic. I don't hmm. know, but it's a size one, it's which I believe is a size sure. small for current Let's keep them. Next up. Or is, that a, is it a medium? I don't know, it's a size one current Elliot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is a Patagonia, size extra small. Oh, this is cute though. I love this print. Patterned dress. It's really like cute. Fit and flare dress. Next up are these Levi's. Someone obviously did this himself, size 30. Um, like army green kind of shorts. I like how they're like they do have this spot, but I didn't think that's a big deal. No, they already look kinda, a little distressing. I was gonna say, I think it kind of adds to it. Yeah, like they've you. got a little distressing there, and they've got some the bottoms. Cute. Then we have this Athleta size extra small, like cap sleeve pattern mm. dress, little drapes. It actually is like layered, like there's two layers to it. Cute. This free people movement, which is adorable. Oh, these are so cute. I love these. Like a metallic silver waistband. This was actually a Ben's find. This was like my best Ben's find that day that we went. They have these really cute like little ruched ankles. Yeah. Yeah, like mesh and ruched ankles. Um, and it actually, the size is cut out, but I would probably say this is a small or extra small. I and it actually, small. if you look close, it's butterflies. I know. That's so cute. Yeah. Then I've got this free people and it is a size small. It's got buttons on the sides and it kind of like peplums out. Little pink top. Cute. Yeah, it's like peach-ish color. Then I've got this pair of Zella. Or is it Z by Zella? It's just Zella, size small. Black leggings. Don't get Zella too often, He's too but good. yeah, black leggings of kind of any of those like more expensive brands do well. I've got this. I love this. this I think this is, is like, so cute. This is really oddly put together. Um, it's got one of them like security it's like, ribbons on it. It's like a uh, metallic kind of like bralette or bra situation. And it's I think for like going to events, like you'd wear it with a skirt. So you don't have to wear like a dress. Yeah. It'd be cute though. Yeah, I don't know. And it's a size, does it even have one? Size four. Okay. And then a couple last things that are things, not clothes. <laughs> this Washington <laughs> Starbucks. Oh, I love these. The Starbucks like ornament, or I guess it could just be like desk decor also. I think you're supposed to put a gift card in it. And it's also, yeah, like the traveled or I've been there line or whatever it's called. 
Super cute though. This is adorable. <gasps> this is a Starbucks mug. It's like one. matte black and gold, and on one side is like a leopard. That's, that's, a, that's really. Is that one of the like whatever. World Wildlife Fund ones? I don't know. It does. It says Sumatra. Hmm. But are there other tigers in Sumatra? I don't know. <laughs> Sumatra a place? Yeah. Oh, I love this. Then I got these like wicker. These are bins finds. Wicker like. Either wall decor or things you put like your pots like on. Like a pot on. Aww. I just, wicker does usually pretty good in the home category, so I got them. I also got this like wicker, either little basket for storing things it's or it looks dish. like a soap dish, yeah. But you could also obviously, again, just put it on your shelf and put some like keys or like whatever in it. <gasps> or like a rock. And a bigger like tray basket. I love once these. Again. I remember we used to have these all over the place when yeah. I was a kid. Good for like sitting on a Picnics. table <gasps> or something. Taking cute Instagram pictures of lemonade. Yeah. So thank you guys for watching. <laughs> and for those that made it the whole like 35 minutes. Hi. Thank, <laughs> thank you. you for making it this long. <laughs> um, let us know what your favorite thing is that we found. And let us know how you've done sourcing lately and how your sales have been lately. Yes. We always like to hear that. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you on Thursday. Bye. Bye.